Hello, 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 hello. Um, this is Kari from Carried Away, and I am here to give a two-day, um, sorry, I'm distracted because the sun is out. I'm in Southern California, and it's been, like, dreary and overcast and nice because it's not too hot, but kind of, you know, kind of depressing. Anyway, um... I am here to give a two-day update. Tuesday. Tuesday morning, I woke up and weighed after my four-point-something um, release. I like that word, a YouTube term or anything, right? Because I always used to say loss, but that kind of, kind of uh, suggests that one might find it later. Release is like, you let it go into the wild. 256.4 I think I, I was up like either 0.4 or 0.6 and um and I was totally okay with it because I know that like around like the 250s I've been there before I wasn't there for long but um I believe in like the whole body um weight set like you know when your you know, when your body remembers a certain weight and then it's just like content to hang out there for a while, so I think mine is like pretty much in the two fifties and I haven't really dipped beyond that. So I know that the two fifties are going to be a little bit more challenging for me. So, you know I'm I'm okay I'm okay with that. I it's expected and I'll adjust accordingly. I won't become discouraged. And I'm saying that now, today, but in two more days, you might need to remind me that I said all of this. Uh, so anyway, um, I was up like 0. 0.6. And um, then I went to the the Lauren Hill uh, concert and in Pomona, which was really, really fun. And um, I was wearing like, I don't know why I was thinking I needed to be cute when I needed to wear tennis shoes, but I wore like little heels. They weren't you know, they weren't tall, really, very tall. And, um, but we stood. We were there for, like, from 8 until, oh, gosh, 8 until uh, 12.30. And we were standing the whole entire time. Standing, jumping, dancing, acting a fool. Um, and so I looked it up because I was curious as to how many calories one could expect to lose if one wanted to go to a concert and stand for four hours. And I found that you lose about 100 calories standing. Yeah, pretty impressive, right? So I think it's like a half of a calorie every time you stand up. So if you're sitting right now, you should just stand up and be happy that you lost a half a pound, or not a half a pound, but that you burned a half a calorie protocol a little bit. And I did have a Diet Coke. Um, but anyway, um, and then I think I was like a little bit low on my water, but I wasn't expecting, I, I wasn't expecting any kind of loss the next day. I thought I might, I might just stay at the same, you know, two, two fifty six point six or whatever it was. Um, I weighed in at two fifty five point six. Is it two fifty five point six? 255.4 I'll put it down there um and at first I thought I was up so I think it was like yeah I think it was 255.6 because I thought I was like up a little bit from the but from before and I was like okay well you know it happens I might have been the diet coke that I drank or it might be that I'm just retaining water because I hadn't drank very much water but I was really impressed with my whole like um, attitude about it. And I just kind of went on with my day and took my HCG and waited, you know, to, you know, have some water and take my vitamins and stuff. And, um, as I was inputting my information, I noticed, wait a second, it's 2.55. Like, Kari, you're down 0.4 from before. Like, you're down. And so, um, I kind of had a little bit of a late celebration, but so yeah, I'm, I'm down 0.4. Pretty cool. Um, I'll take it. 
so today is going pretty well. Um, I ate, um, I usually like, like to have like a piece of fruit for breakfast because I'm so hungry, but I was up for a little bit and then I was so tired that I went and I laid back down and I didn't wake up until about noon again. Is anybody else really tired? Their first, I think. So anyway, um, I woke up and I had a late, or not a late breakfast. I skipped breakfast and then I had, I had a really good, good, good lunch. And then I went to the store and I got the coconut butter and I made up a batch of truffles, lemon truffles. And they are in the fridge right now. And I'm going to take one out because I have like a little phone appointment. And so I'm going to take one out and I'm going to let it warm to room temperature and I'm going to eat it because I... Took a little nibble while I was mixing it up, and I'm pretty sure I'm going to enjoy that little truffle. And I'm going to have some dinner later on, and then I have choir practice tonight. So I just basically gave you, like, my whole life. Were you were you interested? Did you really need to know all that information? Maybe. I'm doing really well. I feel really good. I'm not, I'm not really hungry. Um, I don't really quite know how to explain how what it is that I feel um it's not hunger um yeah I'm not I'm not really hungry I mean it's like yeah I could eat but I don't really need to kind of feeling so I think that's what people call satisfied like normal people who don't have weight issues not sure let me know if you're one of those normal people and you're watching um but that's what it I'm just gonna um take it easy tonight, have a good dinner, um, go to choir practice, drink my water like a good girl. I put some lemon in it um, today, so maybe that'll get things moving. And um, yeah, I'm just, I'm, I'm doing, I'm doing good. I'm in good spirits. Have happy releases and um, yeah, I'll talk to you tomorrow. Bye.